What is going on guys, friends by creating a video guys, and guys, today is finally here, March 17th, 2020. Today is a day y'all been looking forward to for several months now, and it is finally here guys, March 17th, 2020. Man, time has went by so quick, and I just cannot believe it is finally here. But today will be part one of this college fan pack challenge I'm doing. And back in the first week of 2019, um, of October, I decided to kind out a bunch of Division One, Division Two, II, Division Three, and also community colleges as well. I tried to get as many fan pads in as possible. And guys, so there'll be part one of this college fan pad challenge I'm doing. You know, I, do, I know a bunch of y'all been asking, well, Trent, how many fan pads do you have? How many colleges have sent you stuff the last six months? And that is 481 fan pads. Yes, 481 colleges have sent me stuff the last six months. And you guys will be seeing every single one of those fan pads next month or month and a half um so what i'm going to do is i think i'm going to show around 25 to 30 fan pads in each video which it does mean it should be around 18 19 maybe even 20 videos on this i'm not too sure exactly uh, but there should be that many fan pads so somewhere in the area somewhere um and i'm hoping i can post one video a day it might be every other day it might be every it might maybe every other two days sometimes i'm not too sure uh, but there should be around four to five videos on this each week as a goal. And then I'm going to show these by alphabetical order. Um, so, of course, today is part one. And the first one in the alphabet is the letter A. So, of course, today we'll be starting with the colleges with the letter A. And, of course, with the B, C, D, E, and all the way through Z. Um, by the last uh, part of the College Fan Pat Challenge, the last video. Um... So guys, I'm going to start showing these fan packs here in just a minute again, but I want to go and tell you guys right now how that most of these fan packs in because I know a bunch of y'all be asking questions, what's the email, how do you get this college, what do you say in your emails. I know there'll be a bunch of questions and I'm trying to help you guys out as much as possible right now. Um, since Ole Miss is my favorite team, I'll be using Ole Miss as an example for all of these with the missions. Um, just go to Google. Type in Ole Miss Emissions um, on Google. It's usually the first website that pulls up. And again, you can do this whatever school you want to. You do Alabama, LSU, Texas, Michigan State, North Dakota State. I mean, you can do whatever college you want to. You search the school and then type in Emissions. And it's usually the first website that pulls up. And then most high, if you scroll to the bottom of the website, most of the time you can find the email. And the email of these Emissions departments or schools are usually just Emissions at Ole Miss at EDU, some colleges are just a mission with no S, um, I, like a mission at Ole Miss at EDU. Um, but yeah, 90, 95% of the schools use that same email format, which is a mission at Ole Miss at EDU or a missions at Ole Miss at EDU. Um, so for missions, I'll send my email, so just give my name, say, hey, I'm interested in the college here. Anyway, you can send me some more material. Um, my way to help me out make my college decision and then also do mention if there's any way I could receive a pen or a t-shirt That'd be pretty cool as well. And then of course at the end of the email go ahead and give your, uh, go ahead and give your address out as well So that's all I said in my admissions emails And then for the sports teams like basketball baseball football and they also receive fan patch from marketing communications the athletic department um, many teams and departments like that uh, for those, again, just go to Google and just search whatever school you want to. Just type in Ole Miss, Alabama, LSC, do whatever school you want to. Um, but you go to Google, type in Ole Miss, Athletic Staff Directory, and it's usually the first website that pulls up once again. Um, and then for those, I do email if I do email every single one under each department, and then and then and then I cannot talk. And then in those emails. Um, I just say my game, say I'm a huge fan, ask if there's any promotional items or any giveaway items left there from the season. Um, it'd be pretty cool to receive. And then, of course, go ahead and give your address out at the end of the email again. So that is all I said in my emails for those. And then under the outdoor department, that is where you find the outdoor department emails, the marketing department emails, the communication department emails, ticket office. That's where you find the emails for the baseball teams, basketball teams, football um, so if all the sports teams, marketing, communications, athletic department, ticket office, that is how you find all these emails from these colleges. Um, yeah, I know a bunch of y'all be asking the emails from these colleges, and to be honest with y'all, I don't know 90, 95% of these emails that worked, so that's why I'm telling you guys the way to contact these colleges. 
Um, but if you guys do have any more questions, uh, you guys can email me at trentbrowning12 at gmail.com or trentbrowning12 at iCloud.com. Um, if you guys do have any more questions, um, but if you guys actually email, I'm not trying to sound rude, I'm not trying to sound mean to you, but I'm telling you guys exactly right now, I'm telling you guys exactly what to send me emails, and I'm telling you guys exactly how to contact these colleges. Um, but if you do, if you have any more questions, just email me under one of those emails, and I'll try to respond to you as quickly as possible. Um, so I think I have said pretty much everything. There's 481 fan pads. I try to post a fan pack video each day, about 25 to 30 fan pads in each video. Um, you probably still be seeing fan pads on this until mid-April. So I think I've pretty much have said everything now. Um, so I think it is finally time to start showing some fan pads, guys. Um, so the first four fan pads is actually going to be something a little different. Um, and I'm going to show you the alphabetical order. Um, but the, but the first four fan pads are actually coming in from college bowl games. And if you guys watch college football, you guys know if your team does sits and sits are better, uh, you need to play the bowl game in December or January. Um, so back in January, I did contact all the college bowl games asking for, um, if there's any way I could receive a souvenir ticket or any kind of merchandise left over that was not bought by fans. Um, so there was four of these bowl games who were able to send me something. Um, and for these, all I did, I'm going to tell you guys, like, contact all these colleges, tell you guys what department it came from once again. Um, for, so for the bowl games, I just went to the website, went to the contact us form, and then just, I just filled out the contact us form uh, for these. Um, so you just go to the website, fill out the contact us form, and see if you get anything in the mail. So fan pack number one. From the college bowl games and only have four of these once again but fan pack number one and i do have all these numbered from uh from one to 481 so fan pack number one coming from the goodyear cotton bowl in dallas texas pay 50 cents to ship it out these are souvenir tickets souvenir tickets back from the 2019 cotton bowl which was penn state versus memphis i believe so that's pretty cool souvenir tickets from the cotton bowl so that's fan pack number one Fan pack number two coming in from the Hawaii Bowl. Uh, coming in from the yeah, Hawaii Bowl in Honolulu, Hawaii. They paid 50 cents to ship it out. These are souvenir tickets as well. You have two of these. I forgot who was in the Hawaii Bowl this year. Um, but anyway, so pretty cool tickets. Uh, fan pack number three coming in from the Holiday Bowl. Um, coming in from San Diego, California. They paid 50 cents to ship it out. Um, they sent some souvenir tickets out as well, and this was the bid. It was a bid 12 team. I mean, a bid 10 versus Pac 12 team. Um, I forgot who was in the Holiday Bowl this year. Um, anyway, two souvenir tickets. Still pretty cool. So thanks to the Holiday Bowl for those. I'm trying to show these fan pads out as fast as possible to make these videos as short as possible. Um, so fan pad number four. And this is the last bowl game, and this one's come in through FedEx Express. Package weighs uh, two pounds, coming in from the new ERA Pinstripe Bowl, um, which was played at Yankee Stadium in Bronx, New York. And this is a fan pack, once again, coming in from the new ERA Pinstripe Bowl, which was played at Yankee Stadium, and this bowl was Michigan State and Wake Forest. And this is going to be a game day program. Back from the bowl game was back on December 27, 2019. So Michigan State, Wake Forest. Here is a program back for the game, which is pretty cool. So thanks for the new ERA Penis Right Bowl for the program. Greatly appreciate it, guys. So that is the four bowl games. And I kind of thought I'll just, I'll just go ahead and get those out of the way since there's only a few of those. And then we'll actually start with the weather A. And then the B, C, D, and the other way to Z. Um, so now, fan pack number five is actually a college. It starts with the letter A. And then we're the, I think we want to go to fan pack number 25 in this video, I believe. So I think we'll just show 25 fan packs in this video. But fan pack number five. I'm coming in from Albany Christian University in Albany, Texas. They pay $5.30 to ship it out. This one, they're coming in through their admissions department. So, Albany Christian University, 
on my missions office. I sent a couple of booklets here. These booklets pretty much just have information about the school inside. A couple of booklets, brochures, that kind of stuff. Um, here's another one, a little sheet here if you're interested, you can peel the sheet out and then you can send it back to, the, to their uh, university. Um, there's also a pin in here, Albany Christian University pin. Um, there's a postcard, pretty cool, Albany Christian University postcard. And then there's also a Albany Christian University sticker. Okay, and then last of all, this is a t-shirt, which is a size adult large t-shirt. It says ACU on the um, on the front, which is Albany Christian University. And on the back, it says Wildcats. So thanks to Albany Christian um, Office of Admissions for the fan pack. Really appreciate it. Fan pack number six coming in from the Adelphi University volleyball team out in Garden City, New York. They paid two dollars and twenty cents to ship it out. So fan pack number six. Here is a like a thank you note, thank you card here. On the front of this card, this have the whole team, the whole women's volleyball team picture on the front. And then you open it up, and inside it says Trent, thanks for the support. Um, and it says Aldafa University in short at the bottom. So pretty cool thank you card here from them. And then inside you have the T-shirt. Adult extra large t-shirt. It says Adelphi University. I mean, you know, no, Adelphi Volleyball in the front. This is a short sleeve t-shirt. So Adelphi Volleyball on the front, nothing on the back. So thanks to Adelphi University Volleyball team for the fan pack. We greatly appreciate it. Fan pack number seven coming in from the Air Force football team. They pay you $10.40 to ship it out. And this is going to be a game day program uh, back from November the 2nd, 2019, Air Force versus Army. So pretty cool the program back here from Air Force football I sent this way. So Air Force versus Army program. Very, very cool. So thanks to the Air Force football team for the program. Greatly appreciate it. Fan pack number eight is coming in from the University of Akron women's volleyball team the fan pack number eight akron women's volleyball team they have sent a team uh not team picture a this will be autograph picture four by six picture i believe signed by their head women's basketball coach uh what's like it says coach jackson i believe it could be coach jacobs um kind of having a hard time reading this autograph but i think it says jackson or jacobs not too sure. So anyway, Coach Jacob, Coach Jadson, it says Joe Zips. Pretty cool autograph picture. And then here's the 2019-2020 yearbook. Uh, and this yearbook is going to be one for women's and men's basketball teams from this past season, which is very, very cool. So thanks to the Akron women's volleyball team for that fan pack. Greatly appreciate it. Now we got fan pack number nine, and fan pack number nine through eleven is coming in from the same college. Um, all three of these did come in through different ways. Um, so fan pack number nine coming in from the University of Alabama, and this one is coming in from the Enrollment Management Center. They paid a dollar and sixty sixty cents to ship it out. Okay, I think everything's out of there, I believe. Uh, so first of all, here is a thank you other. My address is on here, so let me cover it up right quick. So thank you other from the, uh, there from the University of Alabama. There's a couple of stickers. This one says Alabama Crimson Tide. Here's another one says where legends are made. There's a 2020-2021 fat sheet, front and back. And then this little booklet here is a pretty much this little booklet has information about the college inside. Um, so pretty cool. So that is fan pack number nine. Fan pack number ten is coming in from the Alabama football team. This one's coming in through UPS ground. Package weighs one pound. So the Alabama football team. A box here from them. And this is a game day program. This is actually back from the 2018 season, and they actually got the same exact program last year in the fan pack. Uh, but this one is coming in from the University of Alabama football team back from the Iron Bowl in 2018, Alabama versus Auburn. And running back Damian Harris is on the front of this program. 
which is very, very cool. So there's a the front, there's the back, there's program. So thanks to the Alabama football team for the program. We really appreciate it. Fan pack number 11. This is a fan pack coming in from the um, admissions office here for Alabama. Alabama Crimson Tide admissions office. Got a bunch of stuff in this one. A bunch of stuff. Um, so anyway, first of all, that a couple more of these little booklets here. Um, I received back in the other fan pack. Do have uh, yeah five of these, five of these in this one, and then I do have a bunch of these 2020, 2021 fact sheets again. Uh, here's a bunch of these Alabama stickers, like four or five of these as well. Uh, here's a University of Alabama pennant. This is the first pennant I have shown you guys so far. A bunch more pennants. That will be shown later on throughout this challenge for sure. So University of Alabama pennant. Very, very cool. And then lots of all, they have sent us like 20 or I'm kind of guessing 20 or 25 pins inside here so a bunch of university of alabama pins and also some more stickers in here as well probably 10 or 15 yeah probably 10 or 15 stickers in there it says where legends are made so a bunch of stickers a bunch of pins so this is a very very cool fan pack there from university of alabama thanks to the university of alabama for those fan packs that's greatly appreciated so fan pack number 12 come in from outer how you, how you pronounce this alderson Broadus University in Philippi, West Virginia. They pay one dollar and fifteen cents to ship it out. And this is fan pack number twelve. Not much of this one. It's still pretty cool. And pretty much just have some information about the college. If you're interested in doing the college here, you can fill out the sheet and then you can return it back to them. So not much of that fan pack. But you know it's still pretty cool. That's fan pack number twelve. Fan pack number 13 is coming in from Alfred University. Um, they paid a U.S. postage paid stamp, and it does not say where this one's coming in from, I believe. Okay, it says Buffalo, New York. So Alfred University, Alfred, New York. Okay, so this one has a thank you letter. My address is on here, so we covered it up. So thank you letter. And then you have a little booklet here that has information of the college inside. So Alfred University was fan pack number 13. Fan pack number 14 is come in from Al he pronounces Alger Jenny College in Meaderville, Pennsylvania. And all this is is a little postcard here, a little um, information sheet about you can visit them for a campus visit sometime soon if you're interested in the college here. So Algeny College University out in Pennsylvania, which is pretty cool. So that was fan pack number 14. Number 15 is also common from the same college, Algeny College University, Meville, Pennsylvania. Okay, so this one has a little thank you letter in this one as well. There's another little booklet and a couple more brochures, information sheets about the college. Which is pretty cool. So that is fan pack number 15. Still got 10 more fan packs to do in this video. Uh, number 16 is coming from the American International College in Springfield, Massachusetts. They paid 65 cents to ship it out. So American International College has sent a little thank you letter here. And then you have a pennant inside this one. This is the uh, this is AIC, which is American International College pennant, which is very, very cool. So thanks to the American International College for the um, thank you other and the pennant. Greatly appreciate it. Number 17 is coming in from Anderson University. Um, did not say where they are, but they pay $2.20 to ship it out. Okay, on the back it says Anderson, South Carolina on here. So Anderson... Coming in from um, Anderson, South Carolina. Let's see here. Uh, kind of the same way again with these. Um, some more little information seats. Another little booklet here. Um, so thanks to Anderson University for those. And I'm still trying to do as quickly as possible with these fan pads. So number 18 
This one's coming in from Appalachian State University or App, or App State. This one's coming in from the Department of Athletics. They pay 50 cents to ship it out. So Appalachian State, App State has sent a couple of uh, packet schedules. And this one, you have a total of four 2019 Appalachian State of packet schedules, which is very, very cool. So you have four of those. That's fan pack number 18. Fan pack number 19 is also a fan pack coming in from Appalachian State. And this is the first tube, I believe, I think I've shown so far. And this one, you have a couple of packet schedules and this one as well. A couple of posters. Uh, yes, I believe that's everything, I believe. So in this one, here's a couple of 2019 Appalachian State pocket schedules. You have a total of four of these in this one. And then here are some posters. The rubber band is still around these. So let me just take these off right quick. And there's going to be a total of two posters, I believe. Maybe three. Okay, so these are very wrinkly still. So here is poster number one. And then here is poster. Oops. Yeah, these are still very wrinkly. Here is poster number two. Very, very cool. So thanks to Appalachian State for those posters and the pocket schedules in that one. So that was fan pack number 19. Fan pack number 20. Any guesses, guys? Any guesses where the fan pack number 20 can be coming from? Appalachian State. So do have a total of three fan packs from Appalachian State as well. Just like Alabama. So this one, you have a little information sheet here about the university, information inside, uh, another little brochure type of thing about the college, and then last of all, this is a Bill Thick Pinnock uh, from Appalachian State. So I always enjoy getting these pennants in the mail. So this is pen number three or four, I believe, I've shown so far. So, mm, so Appalachian State University pennant, very, very cool. That was fan pack number 20. Fan pack number 21 coming in from the Anatoc College in Yellow Springs, Ohio. Penny stamp to ship it out. And this one is just going to be a thank you letter, pretty much. Just kind of saying thanks for showing interest in our college. Hope you attend. Kind of stuff like that. So my address is on here. Let me cover it up. So just a thank you letter from Anatoc College. Fan pack number 22. Now, fan pack 22 through 25 is all coming in from the same college. And this one's coming in from the University of Arkansas. The University of Arkansas has sent me four fan packs over the last six months. And all these came in through different ways as well, I believe. Um, so fan pack number 22 coming in from the University of Arkansas, the admissions department. And there's a thank you letter inside this one. Address is on here and we covered it up. So thank you letter from, uh, from Arkansas. That's fan pack number 22. Number 23 is coming in from the Arkansas Razorbacks ticket office. Uh, they paid $3.70 to ship this one out to me. So the Arkansas ticket office. You have the Arkansas Razorbacks little pouch. Well, you will pouch you put on your hat or something like that if you want to, which is pretty cool. And then you have two pair of Arkansas Razorbacks um, sunglasses. These are sponsored by Pepsi, which is very, very cool. So that is fan pack number 23. Fan pack number 24 coming in from Arkansas as well. Coming in from the Department of Athletics. Paid $4.44 to ship it out. Let's see here. So first of all, this is going to be a okay. This is going to be magnetic schedules. Uh, I do have two of these back from the 2019 Arkansas Razorbacks uh, football schedule. So two magnetic 2019 magnetic schedules here from here from Arkansas. Two of those. Here's a couple of chapsticks. You have two of these Arkansas Razorbacks uh, chapsticks. Very very cool. 
Here is a uh, 2019 Arkansas Razorback uh, pocket schedule. Here's a rock, um, Arkansas Razorback sticker. It says one Razorback. Here is a you ain't call these things. I forgot you call these things, but you can swap them on your on your uh, swap them on your arm. It says Arkansas. Just do this, and it wraps around your arm. It's pretty cool. So that's pretty cool. I have one of those. And then last of all, this one to be a Bludgers tag, Arkansas Razorbacks. It says women's basketball. So Arkansas Razorbacks, women's basketball, Bludgers tag. This is very, very cool. And guys, there's one more fan pack left in this video. And then this will be the end of part one. But guys, there's still good news. There's still many videos to come. We are just now getting started pretty good. So fan pack number 25 coming in from Arkansas as well. This one's coming in from the communications department. They pay you five dollars and twenty-four cents to ship this one out to me. So the Arkansas Razorbacks Communications Department. And this one has a um, same ledger tag as well. So one of those. This one has a chapstick in it as well. Here is a 2019 women's basketball, oh no, no, women's track and field, my bad. 2019 um, Arkansas Razorbats women's outdoor track and field national champions pitcher. This is pretty cool. Uh, the bad thing is this one did, did it bend up pretty bad in the mail. It's all wrink, wrinkly and not in the best of shape. But you know, it's still pretty cool, a team pitcher. So you might just had chapstick, a 2019 Women's Track and Field National Champions Team Pitcher. Here's another 2019 uh, football magnetic schedule. Another one Razorback sticker. And then last of all, and this one is a t-shirt. So this is what, t-shirt number four or five now, I believe. Something, it's something like that. Um, so last of all, this is a size uh, adult, extra, adult extra large. Short sleeve t-shirt that says one Razorback. Nothing on the back. So guys, whew, we went through these fan packs pretty quick. So do you guys enjoy, have you guys enjoyed part one so far? I hope you guys do. And if you guys enjoyed part one, guess what? There's good news. There's still like 15 to 20 more videos on this at least. Um, so you know what guys, this is going to be part one of the college fan pack challenge. Many more videos to come. And again guys, if you guys have any questions, uh, you can email me at trentbrowning12 at gmail.com or trentbrowning12 at outcrawl.com and I will try to respond to you as quickly as possible. Um, but again, guys, that will be it for part one. And then there'll be many more videos after this for sure. So I hope you guys enjoy part one because there'll be many videos to come. But guys, this will be it. Please like, subscribe, comment. Thanks again for watching, guys, and we will see you guys in part two, in part three, in part four, and in part 2.5 million. So, you know what, guys? Keep it easy, man. Be safe, be careful, and Trent is out of here.